love you broke my toy. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. You always say that. Well, I am sorry. Well, that won't fix my toy. What's wrong, children? He broke my toy. I told him not to touch it. I said I was sorry. You always say you're sorry. Okay, okay, children. So Caleb broke your toy. But that's not all he did. He ate my ice cream, he went into my room without asking, and he scribbled on my songbook. Well, I am sorry. Sophia, can you think of anything you have done wrong? Well, I forgot to make up my bed. I lost my homework. And I didn't do the dishes. Yes, it's not easy to remember our mistakes. But are you sorry? Do you know what Jehovah does when we are truly sorry? He reminds us at Ephesians 4, 32. It says, God freely forgave you. Sophia, what does it mean to freely forgive? Okay, Caleb, I forgive you. Ah, good children. That makes Jehovah very happy. Anybody know where the mess came from? Uh oh. If, however, a baptized witness makes a practice of breaking the Bible's moral code and does not repent, he or she will be shunned or disfellowshipped. The Bible clearly states remove the wicked man from among yourselves. 1 Corinthians 5.13.